Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for those who don't know, my name is Jennifer Tomazzini and for today's video, I really wanted to do a my, my own Chanel collection. So in this video, I'm gonna show you um, what I own from Chanel. Um, I do not have ready to wear pieces, but I do have bags, shoes, uh, jewelry and leather goods. So if you guys are interested, let's keep watching. So guys, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I would really, really appreciate it. Uh, don't forget to follow me on my social media accounts. I have two Instagram accounts. I will link it down below. And without further ado, let's do it. So, um, a lot of people that follow me um, on YouTube already saw my bags and shoes from Chanel that I own. So I thought to, of course, including them. But I want to talk to you guys about first um, the jewelry that I have and another accessory stuff that I have before I'm going to talk about my bags and shoes. Uh, so I think we will just start with this first, okay? So I love Chanel earrings. I have been a huge uh, fan for their earrings for the longest time. I don't think it's the best thing to spend your money on actually because they're very expensive and of course they're not real gold or real silver, you know, um, but as custom jewelry they're so beautiful and so iconic so that's why I always buy them. Like, not every year but I do love them. I have with me six pairs one of them is actually vintage, I got it from my mom, so I'm just going to show you, um, not in a particular order, although I'm going to show you the first one that I bought, uh, let me just feel, see if we have everything, yeah, these are pretty old, so this one comes in the old package, like the white one, then you open up like this, um, yeah, so it's Chanel on it, and of course I already, um, I spare everything, so I have the box and I also have invoices and everything. Uh, this one is really old, I don't even know how old it is, I think it's from 2000, 2008 or 2009, something like 2009 probably, so whew, it's almost 11 years old. So the first pair that I have, they're actually my first pair, oh my god, they're so old, I think I haven't used them in the longest time. They look like this. I don't even know if the camera can focus. I hope it can focus so you guys can see it, how it looks. They're really, really small. And this one was the first pair and I wanted them so bad. They look like this on. And they're so cute. It looks almost like small buttons in it. And also a little bit like a mother pearl, kind of, but they're very, very old. So I mean, now they're really not that cute anymore. But back in the days, they're like my favorite. I always wear them also at the work and everything. They were so beautiful and so hyped back in the days. They still are. Um, yeah, the next pair is a vintage piece that my mom gave to me. Um, she actually got it as a present from... Um, not a colleague, um, from a client. My mom used to work in a bank, so a client gave to her as a present because she helped him so much, a pair of earrings that he bought in New York City. Uh, but my mom didn't really understand back in the days what it was, uh, so she was not that thrilled about them because they hurt a little bit and also because they were really big. So she felt like, I don't wanna use them and she just left them in a corner at our place and then I said to my mom why do you don't wear Chanel yeah I don't know I don't like them you can have them you can have them so she gave it to me and I use them to death it didn't came with a box that's why they're in the same box as my other pair but I love these so so much I mean look how beautiful they are they're like a bottom um a bottom um earring totally like gold plated these are gold plated these are the real old one with a clip behind. I'm just gonna show you how they look on me. This one, after a while, they hurt, so you do have to take them away. But I mean, this one is a classic, classic piece from Chanel. I hope the camera can pick it up. And they are so beautiful. They're so classic. And I love these to death. But of course, after an hour or two, you do have to take them away because they do hurt a lot. But I personally don't care, I love them so much. So, 
this one is the two, the first two pairs. Then I don't go in a particular order. I don't know what I have in here. Let me just see which one these are. Okay, this one is also one of my favorite. This one comes in the newest box, I think it is. The black one like this. And this one is actually my favorite. Yeah, these are one of my favorite that we have. These ones are also pretty small and I have Swarov's crystal in it and they are like in the champagne kind of gold. And these ones are also pretty small but very, very classic. And they have such a beautiful shine to it. Now maybe the camera don't pick it up but it does have a lot of sparkle and I love these to death. I have been wearing them so, so much and I still actually do. Um, yeah. Then the next pair, let's see which one it is. Uh, yeah, this one is beautiful. This one, no, this one I will show you last because this one comes together with another thing that I'm gonna show you. So I can leave it on the side. Let's see, so this one we talked about. So let's talk about this one. I know this one is the newest. Let's talk about this one then. Yes. These are also one of my favorite with the oldest, with the newest box. It comes with, with velvet covers. And these one are kind of the same as the other one, but they're bigger. And this one is in the silver color and of course with the Swarovski crystals. And these one, they have an amazing, amazing sparkle. I hope the camera can pick it up. These are so beautiful. They're all crystals, all Swarovski crystal, and they do have a beautiful shine to it. And they look like this on, and I adore this. I think I'm gonna put this one on, to be honest. I love this so much. They are everything and more. Look how beautiful they look on. They're so beautiful. This one I'm just gonna put on. They are everything. So, look how beautiful they look. Yeah. So these one are exactly one of my favorites. Then the other pair is my newest and I already talked to you guys about this one. They come in the newest box with instruction on it. The other one do not have it, it's really weird. And these one are like, these are bomb. I wanted a pair of Chanel earrings that was a little bit bigger and not that small as the other one. So that's why I went for this model. This one has uh, pearls, not real pearls of course, but small pearls all over it. And they are bigger. You guys see the difference? I'm gonna show you the difference between this one and the other one. Like these are really, really big. Uh, of course you can buy bigger, they do have bigger ones, but this one was exactly the, the size that I wanted. Um, and I love it so, so much. They're just perfect. They are just perfect. This is the best thing I've ever bought. This I bought for Christmas for myself. I'm really happy I did because I wear them to death already. So that says a lot. The next pair of earrings goes together with another thing and that's why I wanted to show them together. So the first, the, the pair of earrings comes also with the newest package. And this one, I don't know which collection it is. I think it's for certainly three years ago, maybe more. And these one are in the gold color. And these one are pretty beat up because I love this so much. And they are in the gold plated, I told you. No, 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 I don't think they're gold plated, but like in the gold color. And they look so beautiful. I mean, look at this. I hope the camera can focus enough so you guys can see it. And these ones are a little bit bigger than the one that I'm wearing, but just a tiny, tiny bit. But I mean, they are everything. I love this. And the thing is, because this one goes so bad, so good with the other thing that I'm going to show you is because it's the same thing or the same theme, but it's actually a brooch. 
I love brooch. This one bought my mom bought to me as a, I think it was a birthday present, and it looks exactly like the earrings. So this one is the Chanel brooch. I hope the camera can focus enough so you guys can see how beautiful it looks with Swarovski crystal in it, and it's in gold color, yellow yellow gold color. I mean, this one looks amazing, and it's the same, it's actually the same model as the earrings. It's exactly the same. So, usually when I wear this brooch, I will wear, I will wear the same earrings as well. So, I do love to wear this brooch on a hat. I also have been wearing, usually on a coat or a jeans jacket like this. I also love it to wear it on dresses. I do love to wear it on a scarf. Scarf, they are very like delicate, so I try not to wear it, but sometimes I do. For example, on my Louis Vuitton uh, wool scarf, I will add this one on. But I mean, also on a dress, it looks great. And the color is so beautiful. It's more like a champagne color, so it's not that gold. Uh, so you can use every accessories. If you have gold, white gold accessory or yellow gold, I mean, it looks perfect with this one as well. So, I mean, it looks so classic, so beautiful, and it's not too big that it's overwhelming. So, I'm so happy my mom, my, bought, my mom bought this one to me. Yeah. Another piece that I have is actually um, a belt. And this belt was very popular back in the days. It's a vintage piece. Uh, then no one talked about it anymore, and now it's actually in again. So a lot of people want to buy this one in the vintage stores, but it's very difficult to find because it's a very high demand on it. And I think this one goes over a thousand uh, in the vintage store. And um, I got this one as a present long, 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 long time ago. I think it went for 500 euros or something. And this one is actually a vintage piece. Do you guys see how beautiful it is? I mean, look at this one. It's everything. Look how beautiful it is. It's so beautiful. And this one you just wear, you just wear around your waist or more above if you want. And it's just everything. I'm just gonna show you how it will look on me. This one looks like this. You can also make it smaller if you want. You can put it on this side and then it will look a little bit more like this. But it actually has to be like that, I think. Like this. Yes, yeah, so I do love this piece so much. I don't wait, I don't wear it that much. But to be honest, it's a typical classic Chanel piece and it's very, very heavy because it's in 24 carats gold plated gold. So it's very, very heavy, but it looks beautiful, especially on a black dress, for example. This one will look beautiful on it. So it's a classic piece, a vintage piece. I will never sell it personally. Um, it's amazing. I love this one so, so much. I'm so, so happy about it. Next is a small little goods item that I have, and this one is actually the only one that I own. That's really weird to say because I do love Chanel. Um, and this one is actually something that I'm still using a ton. I always have it since I bought it. And this one is actually the Chanel card holder uh, in the lab skin with a silk hardware. And let me take away my cards. So, but it looks like this. You have one compartment here in the front, and then here you have a bigger one where you can put everything inside. I have a lot of cards, so like more than 10, most certainly, and it's just a beautiful, beautiful card holder. Not that big. You can put everything in it, and you can use them for all your small bags. It always will fit. So this one I never got rid of. I will never get sick of it. It's just perfection. You can also put your coins inside. I personally do that, but you can do that as well. So yeah, I'm so happy about this. Like I'm not complaining at all. I do recommend this one at all. If I had to choose, I would personally suggest to buy the caviar one. 
uh, because I'm really careful about this when it's lambskin, to be honest. But they didn't have the carrier leather. That's why I bought the lambskin one. But it's such a beautiful, beautiful piece. It's just everything. So I'm so happy about it. Next, we're talking about shoes that I have from Chanel. And I have three pairs. Um, two are espadrillas. You maybe already know that. And the third pair is a pair of ballerinas. So the first pair of espadrillas, they are own. Uh, quite dirty I'm so sorry about this but this one are the classic espadrilla with the pearl color is a limited edition one with the black uh, texture so I think this one is actually a calf leather skin calf leather and this one is just texture sorry they're very very dirty but I mean this one I have been using a ton uh, I went on a like I went crazy for these shoes. I wanted this so bad, but the pearl one, no one had it because it was a limited edition during summer, I think, and then it just disappear. And I want this so, so bad. And I finally found them and I wear this the whole summer long. This one is probably my third summer using these. I have been using them everywhere, like in Bali, in Dubai, uh, in Italy, like everywhere during summer I have, in Thailand, I've been using these. They are so comfortable, they are so beautiful. This one is a size, doesn't say, ah, 39, 39, and they are perfect for me. And the color is everything, so I do recommend this one so, so much. When these broke, I'll buy new ones because I love them so much. Next espadrilla say I have are actually my first one and this one I bought in Munich uh, on a trip with my husband and these one are my first pair and after this I just wanted more and more. I love this one so much. This one is also in a size 39. This one are in this one is actually just um, normal material um, and the other one is like blue patent leather. So they are marine blue color and they're so beautiful. Um, look at this. These I haven't used as much as the white ones just because this pattern letter is a little bit more difficult to use, but I still love them to death and I still wear them a lot, but not as much as the white one. I think the, the white one usually easier to style, uh, so that's why I've been wearing them more, but I mean, these one are also everything. And they're very understated. You don't really see that it's Chanel if you don't really look up close, right? So yeah, I love this one so, so much. Third pair of shoes is also a pair that I have been using so much, so they are also very beaten. And these one are the Chanel Ballerinas ones, the classic with the beige and the black one. Um, this one I have been using so much I don't want to show you the sole because oh my god they have been they have been everywhere in the rain in the summer like during spring like everywhere they're so so dirty but I love this one to death they are very comfortable they are the most comfortable shoes I own I think this one is a size 40 I think they're a little bit too big of me but I do not care uh, they're still very comfortable and they are really cute I do not actually love ballerinas at all but I do love these ones so these one are the only ballerina that I will ever wear <laughs> so now about bags the first bag that I ever bought from Chanel is actually the vintage piece and this one is the classic 2.55 uh, in the medium size lambskin, black lambskin with gold hardware. And this one is the gold plated one. Uh, this bag is really old. It's like one year younger than me. I think it's 31 years old. It's from 1989. Um, comes of course with the chain, the gold plated chain, 24 um, carats gold. Uh, is actually in perfect condition is red inside and it, it does have the authenticity car and it's everything inside it's so so beautiful of course it's not puffy anymore it's still very shiny but it's not as puffy as it was before but I love this bag so much I have been using this a ton I still do I feel like it's such a classic piece and I will never get rid of it until it broke it will still be with me forever. I love this piece so, so much. And I love to wear it crossbody. I feel like it looks so elegant, but also like this on the shoulder, 
Um, I mean, it's a classic piece, right? Next bag that I bought is actually a Chanel boy bag. This one I bought in Rome at the Chanel store during summer. This one was exactly uh, when the Chanel boy bag got really, really popular and everyone wanted it and it was sold out everywhere. And I wanted the Chevron bag one and that's what I found also in Rome. So this one is the Chanel boy in the medium size. Uh, the old medium, of course, in the chevron calfskin leather with silver hardware, but this one is with the ox oxenized silver, so the darker one. And this one looks just great. Inside is also red. Inside it's red, I do have a lot of stuff inside. And it's just beautiful. I love this bag so much. This one is probably my favorite bag in my whole collection of bags that I own. Uh, I will never get rid of it. I use this one still to death and I just love this one so so much. It's just explain how I am as a person. I feel like Chanel Boy is me in a bag. So I love this one so much. Next bag and the last bag of my um, Chanel collection is another Chanel Boy that you guys already saw. And this one I bought also in the vintage store, but it will never it was never used. It came with a authenticity card, with a box, with everything, with a dust bag and everything, and invoice as well. This one is actually a small Chanel Boy. Mm, so cute. This one is a small Chanel Boy. Uh, in velvet this time, black velvet with silver or oxidized um, uh, hardware. And I wanted a small Chanel boy for the longest time since I bought my medium one. I thought I was a medium person, but to be honest, I'm more for these small bags. I feel like I don't have a lot in my bag anyway, and I love the look of it. So I love this one. This one was one of my best purchases that I ever made. I'm so happy I did. And yeah. I love it so much, so, so, so much. So guys, that was it for my YouTube video. This one is actually my whole Chanel collection. I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, if you like, you click a thumbs up and you can also comment down below if you have any questions and I will answer you as soon as I see it. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful evening, okay? Bye.